In today's video, I'm going to show you how to check your private relay email or hide my email on your iPhone. Before we get started, it's worth noting that hide my email is only available with an iCloud Plus subscription. The first thing we need to do is to go into the settings application and then you want to find your name at the top and click into that. You then want to find where it says iCloud and click into that. And then you want to scroll all the way to the bottom to where it says iCloud Plus features. Here you should see the hide my email option, so you want to click into that. Now after a few seconds, this will show you a list of all of the hide my emails that you have created. Now as you can see, I have one that's currently being created. So if I click into that, I can see more options. And here you can see this was created in the Safari browser on the website boots.com. And I've also put a note for newsletters as I use this email to sign up for newsletters through that website. Near the top, it's going to show you the hide my email email address that the emails will get sent to. However, they will be forwarded to your actual email. And in this example, it's going to be my Gmail address. Now the email address it decides to send it to is going to be the one that you have used to sign into your iCloud account on your iPhone. If you want to deactivate this email address so you no longer receive emails from it, you want to click on deactivate email address. And again, in the pop-up menu, you want to select deactivate. If you want to create a new private email that you want to forward emails from, you want to click on create new address. And here you can go ahead and choose which address you'd like to use by clicking on the use different address button. And then you want to go ahead and give it a label. So for this example, I'm going to call it burner. Once you're ready, you want to click on next. And then you want to click on done. And now you can use this email address to forward emails to your primary email address. And that's it. So if this video is helpful, please leave a like. And if you have any questions or comments, you can leave them below.